in this video i will show you how to execute powershell command remotely from your linux system using python okay first we need to install a ssh server in your windows system but let follow these articles so you can install the linux server free sshd into your windows system and it, uh, i will show you i installed one free sshd in my system so you can see this in task manager you can see the service the process sshd free sshd is running okay go to settings of free sshd there you can see ssh service is running this should be in this state okay then go to the user uh, tab here you can see one user so we should add one user like this okay if you go to user details you can see username and one shell option because this is okay so we, we need these two settings user and ssh service should be in running state okay let me first we need to check the ssh to your windows system using it's from linux machine first test that okay and password okay right now it's working it's, here you can see one path windows system 32 windows powershell v version v1 why it's directly going to that because in, in this option i given that path windows system 32 windows powershell v1 powershell.exe in this command shell field i filled I given that powershell path that's why it's directly going to powershell if you give the cmd path you will go to cmd let me execute one powershell command get to vm host so here you can see the output of that powershell command let me try another command get vm not there is no vm okay so in this way we can log into windows system from yours in system and we can run our shell command okay so here so let me show one python program in oh, let me open this program this program will execute partial command import parameter parameter dot such client is a client program set missing host key policy parameter dot add policy then ssh dot connect is host name username and password this is a command i am going to execute this is a powershell name powershell program name input format and output format text this is the hyper-v command get ssh vm host then executing the command then I am printing the output here. Okay, this is a Python client program to execute the partial command from this system. Okay. Get okay, let me go to my, my Linux terminal and let me run that program Python hyper v underscore remote dot by it's showing one error authentication failed because I given wrong username and password let me change the username password okay I change username and password of Windows system that's okay let me try again okay it's working you see here you can see the same output what we saw in powershell terminal here okay the same output machine migration enabled and this same output we can see here okay we can now try now we given that 
output format to test let me change it to xml so we can see the that program will give the output in xml format let me try, run that program again so now you can see the output right now the output is in xml format okay let me try nine output supported values of output format are none text and xml none means it will not give anything it will give an empty list okay so we, sh we should use either text or xml text let me try test again now you can see i'll put in test format okay let me try another command another partial hyper v command get vm get vm will list all vms in this hyper v node now right now there is no vm i haven't created any vm so let me create some other powershell commands mm. i am using windows 2008 hyper-v machine that's why i can i am running this vm get vm host and powershell no, hyper-v commands like with get vm host get vm these are hyper-v commands get more you let me try that command in this get an hyphen module let me run that program again showing md list mm, i don't know why it's showing giving md list let me run this command get command minus module hyper v minus verb star just copy just type that here get command so hyphen module let me so wait so let me arrange the window so i can type it hyphen module hyphen v hyphen verb okay okay let me run the program python program mm, missing argument for parameter oh okay i think i mixed that star at the end me run this command in powershell get module get module is running in powershell but it's not giving in the output when i run it in via python i don't know let me try this command in powershell VRB where get command missing the no, that star is missing there to end let me try get module again why not get module is not showing I don't know why it's not showing me. Let me copy that command and paste it in 
PowerShell terminal. In PowerShell terminal, it's working. Mm. No, in Python program, I forgot to put that stuff. Wait, wait, wait. Get, get command let me copy that okay minus your star this star was missing that's why we, we aren't seeing any output there so let me run this program again Okay. okay now you can see the output output is in text format name module name Get command let me put a hyphen at the big start talent also we can't use siphon now just try that just remove that so we can't use any single quotes or double quotes around the command so okay bye